What up? What is going on, everybody? It's your boy GS. Welcome back to another Madden 15 online ranked match. And today, we have the Buccaneers going up against the Minnesota Vikings. Nice to see from the title. Just throw it up, throw it up, throw it up. Watch it all fall out. Yo, these Bucks got two Jermaine O'Neals. Just big old goofy, tall, slinky receivers. They just throw it up and just have fun. After seeing what the Chicago Bears done did to me, I feel like, hey, all you got to do is throw it up to these tall bastards, and they're going to make things happen. So, right, they throw an incomplete pass, and we force a fourth down, and he decides to go for it. No fourth down swag. And don't test the Houston. He is so disrespectful. Don't be over there testing the user, young blood. So after that interception right there, you guys should have heard me. As I said that, like right now, as I said, disrespectful. My son is on the couch. He's me doing a commentary. And I go, disrespectful. And he goes, respectful. <laughs> right here, throw it up, throw it up. <laughs> Look at big old Evan just coming down with the ball. I'm telling you, man, these big old tall bastards just throw it up there and just have fun with it. Oh, man, this team is going to be a lot of fun to use in Madden. I think this is my first time using the Buccaneers. So we're going up against Purple Jesus. And, oh, man, that right there looked like it should have been snagged. And uh, I'm hoping that Agent Peterson don't go crazy. Don't go crazy on me, AP. No, you know you're my boy. You know you're my boy. Don't go. Don't be going crazy on me, man. I don't I don't need that in my life. You know what I'm saying? I'm, a, I'm bad on defense as it is. Last thing I need is somebody who's running the ball successful on me. That's just going to complicate things, man. I ain't trying to complicate things. Fourth down decides to go with a sweep. And I thought we had him, but big old stank AP just falls forward. That big old greasy bastard just slipping and dodging forward. Man, this guy is such a monster in the game. Like, uh, whew. Man, a lot of fun using AP. And it can be very frustrating trying to stop him. So, again, you know, he's mixing in a lot of runs, a lot of tosses, a lot of, you know, uh, inside, uh, like, HB zones, whatever the hell they call it. I don't, I don't know. I don't, he's giving the ball to AP. That's what I know. Give it the ball to AP. And you can't go wrong with that. That's a good, legit, strategic move right there. If I got the Vikings, I'm giving about an AP all the damn time because he can make a lot of things happen. Uh, right there, we force an incomplete pass, forcing another fourth down. He decides to go on ahead and take us three points. So we have an opportunity to go on ahead and take a multiple position lead, though. And if you guys know me, you guys know I live the multiple position lead. So here we go with Dempsey, man, trying to, trying to get him a little wiggle sticks back there, but we don't get anything. So, right, we back up and we get set. We had the flats wide open with B, but we just missed it. So, just trying to run the ball, see what we can do. But Dougie 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 teach me how to do Damn, you ain't teaching no how to do nothing. You teach him how to get three yards and a fall. Get down, son. So, right here, try to pick up the first down. Unfortunately, we don't. And unlike our disrespectful opponent, we got fourth down swag, baby. If you stop me on three downs, you deserve the ball. That's that's how I feel. That's how I feel. So, here we go, man. Our defense got to, you know, uh, do... A good job of stopping his men. And so far, so good. Can't complain. You know, uh, haven't completely shut him out or anything like that. But, you know, we, we've done a good job thus far of being able to maintain uh, AP from getting too loose. Right there. Whoa, that tight end was open. Thankfully, he didn't throw it. Right there. We dropped the user interception. EA, you, you got to reward the user, baby. You just got to reward the user. Right there. Another drop pass right there. These Vikings are dropping a lot of stuff. Right there. Nice little pass right there. Ends up getting a huge first down you know continuing to drive you know so far this game we've done a pretty decent job of being able to force fourth downs but uh right there we couldn't do that on, uh right there so over the middle had them streaking but just overthrown and uh, the inaccuracy passes in this game can be extremely frustrating so he kicks a field goal right there and now we have 18 seconds to see if we could get downfield and make something happen maybe we get a good uh kick with uh, <laughs> maybe we get ourselves a good kickoff return and see what we can make happen so here we go with dance man go ahead with the wiggles hit him with the wiggles man the hips don't lie oh don't they line today they line today so 14 seconds left, we look in and quick little pass to Demps and, you know, call a quick little timeout. Nine seconds left. Quick little out route to Jackson. Whoop! And whoop! Get off me, Sonny. So strong, though. That big bastard so strong. Tiptoeing in my cleats on the sideline. Ends up allowing us to kick a field goal. So we drive downfield, kick a field goal, and we get ball back at halftime. And if you ask me, that's scientifically proven that that's astronomically biblical. It's all in science. It's all science does not lie. Science did not lie, man. Science is scientifically proven. That's why it's scientifically science facts. You know what I'm saying? That's why it's scientific. 
So here we go back with Martin, trying to get a run game going of our own. And we just can't get anything going. Every time we run, these Vikings come all over the place. So we think we hit him off guard with the screen. And look at Nemps, you big old speedy bastard. You, that was his speed, like 98. Wasn't he used to be like in track or something? Like, wherever the hell he was, he's, he's mighty fast. He's mighty, 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 mighty quick. He's definitely somebody you want to be able to utilize in the game because he's just so quick. With that 98 speed, he has the opportunity to make a simple play, you know, turn into a touchdown. So um, he's not my main back. Obviously, it's, it's uh, Dougie. But uh, you, you got to mix in some Demps every now and then, you know, get him in the game plan. Because like I said, that speed is absolutely terrifying. So um, you got to try and sneak him in when you can. Ryan Murphy Jr. going, yeet. Just jump right over. Did I say that right? Jump right over him. Yeet. I, I guess I do that, right? Or am I supposed to hit like a, a, a girl in the back of the head with a shovel? Yeet. I don't know. I watch too much Vine. Somebody said in the other video, like, yes, you be on Vine too much. I do. I do. Uh, I be on Facebook all day just looking for Vines. I don't even know how to find Vines I'm on. I just go to Facebook and watch what other people do. Right there, Adrian Peterson. He looks like he could go. Uh, the way that big old purple Jesus ends up scampering on into the end zone time. Well, not time, but uh, matching our score immediately. How did he catch that? That man looked like John Elway with the little helicopter spin right there. So now we are up three. Two minutes remaining. Plenty of time for him to make something happen if he's able to go on ahead and uh, force the punt, which of course we don't want. We want to be able to continue driving, moving the ball downfield, making things happen. We go to, oh, whew, Dougie got killed. Five rushes for five yards. We're really not doing that good of a job running the ball. But Vincent Jackson is doing a great job of receiving. Look at that. He can't even be brought down. He can't even be brought down. He's just so damn tall for no reason. For absolutely no reason. You shouldn't be that tall in the receiver. That's just not fair. Murphy Jr. right here just sneaking past the first down marker, allowing us to continue the drive. We are almost in field goal range, but of course we don't want that. Right there, throw it up, throw it up. Watch it off. Uh, another. And I said another touchdown by Evans. Just throwing it up there and let him go get it. I'm telling you, man, these big, tall Jermaine O'Neal receivers, you just throw it up there. And they will come down with it. It's such an extremely fun team to play with. We got those two Mongeese Necks receivers over. Mongeese Necks? Is that? A, I don't know. Well, it's a word today. Them big old Mongeese Necks just back there just ball hawking everything offensively. So, you know, he's still running the ball. And, again, I can't blame him. He's uh, definitely stepped it up in the second half. 18 rushes, 120 yards. AP doing what he does best. Running around people. When he gets tackled, it takes multiple people. And he's falling forward like the beast that he is. So, all right, drops back the pass. Well, we kind of lurk it. We force the incomplete pass. So, fourth down opportunity right here. And he goes for a run and another uh, fourth down where Adrian Peterson comes through for him. So, uh, you know, he's, he's starting to move the ball better than what he was before. Teddy Bridgewater goes. That right there was a dot. Beautiful pass. I put the safety in a yellow. And he ends up just screaming through uh, right over the top. And... My fault should have left him in the deep blue. I wasn't expecting that type of play. So, uh, offensively, man, with only a few minutes remaining, we can win this game here. It's not necessary that we score. All we really have to do is keep the ball away from him. And this is why Demps is so beast. Once he hits that outside, he's he's a dangerous man. And how many points the Vikings got? 21. <laughs> you stupid. 21. All right, two minutes remaining. We need this first down. We go to James, and we do not get it. And y'all know the rules. Fourth and inches, but you know the rules. We punt. I don't want my defense on the field, but fourth down swag, man. Live it, learn it, love it, son. You need to live this fourth down swag. So now our defense is on the field, man. I'm telling you, we may be the only ones trying to win this way. Everybody else goes for it on fourth down, not us. We put our assness of a defense on the field to try and make our team better. Even though it probably, you know, statistically, I probably, I don't know, I'll probably win more games going for it on fourth down. Because I'm sure, you know, these punts turn into scores against me. But nonetheless, the stuff I got to figure out. Oh, that three-man B-gap coming out of Dream. I had to hit him with a sprinkle of Dream. I had to. By the way, man, ebook is in the description. Go ahead and check that out. Sign up for your free Madden Mastermind account. Where my offensive uh, guide will be there this year. As we still the deal with that interception right there. Now, we all know I'm not the best player in the world. But I have managed to make the top 100 the last few years. And I know that's nothing. Trust me. I know that's nothing to put on a resume, but uh, being in the top 100 just shows that I'm able to compete online and win, uh, you know, and I've been able to do that last several years. So um, the offense that I'm using, you know, will be there available for you guys, MadamMastermind.com very soon. Not showing sure probably another week or two where I'm going to go ahead and get everything ready for you guys. So definitely sign up for your free account. Like I said, my offensive scheme will be there and you're not going to go to, you know, Atlanta and win any tournaments with my offense. Trust me. 
But if you're struggling at the game, it possibly can make you just a little bit better. You know, and that's all that I ask for that these things do. If they can make you a little bit better, then, you know, job well done. So that's the end of the game, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, represent that by hitting that like button. It's your boy, Jess, and we are out. Peace. Give it to me, baby.